My name is Adam Hornback. I am the administrator of North Texas Team Care Surgery Center in Mesquite, Texas. We are a multi-specialty surgery center that is fully physician owned, no partnership of any sort. We are primarily focused on pain, GI, general, and orthopedics. So we started, I believe last summer with HST. We currently use the scheduling software, so HST practice management. We use the charting program, eChart. We use the case coordination software, and then we also use the Clarity software as well. So before HST, we were on SIS. We were on the SIS program. We had used that for several years. I went through several iterations from AMCHI through to SIS, through to SIS Complete. So the problem was multifold. One of the issues that we had was consistency and then as well as efficiency and all honestly accuracy. We would run reports that wouldn't match. We would have billing issues. There were several billing issues as well. And again, not to negatively talk, but customer service was not necessarily as helpful either. Downtime, implementation time, and honestly, if the program would work like it was sold. So I feel that the product does what it says is going to do. I have learned over the vast time of implementations that every software has its issues. Implementation is challenging with any system to say the least. We get more benefits from all the systems working together seamlessly, which is one of the issues that we did have before. So I've worked around HST Pathways for several years. I've known of it. I've spoke with several different administrators and clinical users that use the product, and they were very happy. Could not stop raving about it. So it was a combination of a small amount of experience and other people raving about the program. My favorite is the case coordination program. Now we do not utilize it to its maximum yet. However, the ability to communicate between the offices and the facility, the ability to communicate between reps and the facility, those are great items. Plus the notification features, all very nice. I like that very much. I don't know that it's changed a terrible amount, but I do feel that the system has some things that are easier to manipulate and manage. I feel like there are reporting systems within the system so that you don't have to go outside to go to multiple reports to get what you need as often. I feel like the reporting system is good. Being an administrator, I'm constantly trending. So you need reports that you can follow that and you need them to be accurate. I found that these are absolutely more accurate as far as just maintaining numbers of cases, numbers, you know, our AR, our collections, etc. All of that has been much more accurate and fairly easy to attain. So one of the goals that we were looking at is to improve our case costing. I feel like we are able to do that with the system improvement in case costing and improvement in tracking the cost. When you're inter-op, working with the case costing feature, working off the preference card, I feel like it's an easier manipulation in this system than previous ones, and that has been very helpful. Yeah, absolutely. So one of the things that you struggle with with an EMR is clinical staff paying more attention to the software than to the patient. So with this system, we found that we're able to put them on tablets, which we were not able to do with the previous system. We are able to lessen the clicks, meaning that we have more time to actually pay attention to our patients and less time with the documentation, yet still getting the information that we need for that patient visit. 